Wisconsin saw a high voter turnout Tuesday. Before the polls even opened, nearly 2 million Wisconsinites had already voted, either by mail or early in person. That number is about 65% of total ballots cast in 2016. In all, more than 70% of the voting age population voted in Wisconsin. Let's go to Jennifer Cleasy in the newsroom. She's looking at the election results to show us where that turnout likely made a difference in Joe Biden's win here in Wisconsin. Jen. Well, Amber, turnout was up for both candidates kind of across the board, but there were certainly places where it made a big difference for Joe Biden. Let's take a look at Dane County. These are the 2020 results. He won with 76% of the vote, 260,000 votes. And if we look at 2016 results, you can see, oh, I switched back to 2020. You can see in 2016, Hillary Clinton won with only 71%. So there was a significant increase there. We can also 80% of voters turned down in Dane County and in Rock County, we can look at that as well. 70% of voters turned out there in 2016. Only 52% went to Hillary Clinton. 55% went to Joe Biden. Milwaukee was also really huge. There were some areas that were supporting the president and we can look at Washington County near Milwaukee where 94% of voters showed up to vote and the president won handily 68% but it just wasn't enough across the state and Joe Biden obviously as we know now won.